Devil's Tower National Monument is located in northeastern Wyoming and was established on September 24, 1906 by Theodore Roosevelt. The tower rises 1,267 feet above the land around it and its summit is located at 5,114 feet above sea level. More than 400,000 people visit this monument each year. Roughly 1% of these visitors come to climb this massive tower. There are many different theories on how Devil's Tower was formed. The most popular explanation is that the tower was formed by magma, which cooled underground and was eventually exposed by erosion. However, scientists are still not exactly sure how this spectacular structure came to be. When we first arrived, we were blown away by the awesome size and beauty of this place. For many centuries, Native Americans used this place to pray and hold rituals with their tribes. The tower is still very sacred to many Native American tribes today. Uh, so if you do come to um, Devil's Tower in Wyoming, um, it is really neat just to look at it from the car. It's, I mean, it's huge. Can't really see it now. But there is this one little trail you can take, a loop trail, which is about uh, 1.3 miles around. Um, and it's really, really nice if you have the time or if you're on a road trip like us and you want to kind of stretch your legs a little bit. It is really nice to go on. You walk through this beautiful pine forest and just very peaceful. There are a lot of people that's going to be kind of hard to avoid around here, but it isn't really that big of a deal. I don't mind them, them that much. But if you do have the opportunity to walk through here and do this uh, trail around the, the tower, do it. It's so worth it. Although our time was short here, we still really got to enjoy this breathtaking place. And it has become one of my favorite places on earth. <laughs>